Come on, my guy. <laughs> Take the high road. <laughs> Is this not the normal time? Yeah. Ah, uh, yeah. They just finished playing. It's hard to dismantle that. Uh, it's hard to dismantle that. Yeah. Them and or the Celtics when it comes down to champ, but Lakers ultimately, I guess. Yeah. I mean the Celtics. And they just restocked. Did they lose anybody really? Yeah. They lost, they lost, um, you know, Rondo, they lost, um, uh, Green, they lost, you know, they lost, they lost. Yeah, they got DeRoz DeMar DeRozan for them, didn't they? Not for them. No, they got, uh, uh, the dude from Oklahoma City. Oh, the, the, yeah, yeah. Schroeder. Think so? Yeah. Oh, Montrez Harrell. Yeah. yeah. It's like, it's 
sort of page you see in this game that doesn't make sure that you're about because you're hard to really keep longer. This one on. Take one. We'll come back next and do one. But right now, it's still both are on plant. Outside leg. Transition. Outside plant. Stay low, stay low, stay low. It's like base it's still in the uh, running bases. So, lateral leg, this one, right? Same thing. Both are staying low. Yes, Dion, it's lateral quickness, correct? Lateral quickness, so we're just making him being able to steal side to side so he can push up. So we're making sure we're keeping all our weight on the outside leg, creating force. Same thing coming back. Good. 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 No matter how old. I've been doing it for this many years. <laughs> and it still give me every single time. <laughs> Alright, so remember, big step, make sure you shoot. Alright? So big step, small step. Explosive. What's your favorite workout with the band? The band? Man, I 
the other stuff we doing right now, so all the explosive stuff, the shuffling, the back pedals, broad jumps. I love explosive stuff, so I always keep them on these. Every offseason, it's first thing we get back to the band. And you see, you see what, dog? You see what? <laughs> Never seen that. Yeah. 
Yeah. I'm just getting different angles. <laughs> And he seems like the nicest guy. Super oh, cool. Yeah. <laughs> Five
good though, right? <laughs> Oh, man. Good morning. Sometimes you just wake up late. Why? And I still don't know why. Yeah, y'all did this 6.30. This <laughs> could have waited till 8. <laughs> I don't know. I don't know why. I'm here because I know he got that slot. <laughs> and I got the puppy, man. The puppy don't allow me to do stuff there the day. Right your feet, stay low, arms. Especially after all of that. You don't like protein shit? No, I don't like protein. I'd rather eat. Facts. But I should do both. I'm gonna hit up Smoothie King real quick. Get things open. Yeah, they open. What you recommend to Smoothie King, Dion? Because I'd be on that strawberry gladiator. Is that a protein? Nah. I get the hook when I go. Oh, that's the juice. No, nah, it's um, it's a shake, but it's... I mean, like, it's got green stuff in it? No, 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 no. Okay. Uh, it has, um, what we call ice cream, oh, um, cream cheese, and I get a chocolate, you get a different flavor, but I get that, and I add um, peanut butter, and I add um, whey protein to it. Wait, is protein dairy? Depending on what kind it is. Because I'm so, vegan. You get a vegan option. Okay. Yeah, you get a plant based. I ain't gonna lie, bro. Since I've been vegan, my body's never felt better. For real? I never felt better. How many months? I mean, you only done it a couple weeks, no, right? I only done it. Uh, really, 
10 days, roughly. But vegan, like, it's vegan, but I still eat chicken and fish. Gotcha. So basically, no dairy at all. And you can tell already? Oh, man. My body feels amazing. It doesn't matter what I do, I don't really get sore. I feel like my knees don't hurt. I usually, by this time, like, I'm sore, like, my knees are hurting a little bit. Which is, you know, comes with it, but, but I feel great. And usually when I do the basketball workouts and stuff, mm -hmm. like, yeah. my body is like a little sore. Sore, like you just play the people. game type deal. Yeah, now, now it's just like, I can do whatever I want. I'm not gonna get sore. You been combining that. How long y'all been working out this seat? Like this off season, y'all just started back? We just started back, we just started back. We, we waited later because shit, I didn't end until. Oh, yeah, you want more series? Yeah, <laughs> late October. Yeah. So now you're gonna see how that combines with uh, these workouts. But I mean, if you're doing going through those basketball, because you work out with Spencer for like an hour and a half, aren't you? Yeah, no, yeah exactly. Just shooting. Yeah. It's, that's condition. That's not condition. <laughs> I can't run on a treadmill. I can get you a Here's mile. We'll be running, doing our football routes. Yeah. That will be conditioned. How long you been training with Mook? Oh uh, man, Mook, we started in 2013, so it's been it's been a it's been a ascent, you should say. Because I got him right out of single A. Yeah. So what people don't realize is, you know, it's different levels to the minor. So he started at the lowest level and he worked his way all the way up. So when I got him, zero home runs, he came to me like, man, I have no power. Mutual friend hooked us up. Yeah. I told him, man, you serious, man, to show up at the gym. He showed up that day, and we ain't turned back since. So 2013 to now, to see the growth, I mean, it's, it's unbelievable. And then with Training Corner, you've been doing that for what? Yeah, so Training Corner, before I actually had my brick and mortar building, I probably was doing it uh, maybe three or four years. So all together, about 12, 13 years in. Jeez. Uh, so the building came about in like 2012, but I started training in the building in 2013. So. From elementary to pros? Really. Like from seven to seventy-one, from youth, high school, collegiate, and of course pro. So yeah, it's, it's it's been a blessing, man. Like yeah. the stuff that we do, the, the knowledge, and just to to me the camaraderie. You know what I mean? Like Mook's not only a, a, a client, but he's my friend first. So Facts. to see him make the transition and the leap to where he is now, man, it's, I'm just blessed. Facts. He's blessed. So I guess. Training corner, Mook, I mean, everything in Nashville, y'all, you've been moving on a heavy stride since 2013, 2021. I know 2020 COVID was crazy, but I didn't see you slow down. Nah, man, we actually, man, God blessed us enough to, especially me, myself, to where uh, actually picked up people. Yeah. So instead of us being inside, hey, we just made a pivot and did outside. So more people, more people trying to, you know, have that fitness at a level that it needs to be because at the end of the day, the reality is for the COVID, to protect yourself from it, your fitness level needs to be at a certain point. Nice. So we can get all the vaccinations in the world, but if your body can't fight off and if your immune system isn't where it needs to be, then you know, you're know you gonna have a hard time. With it. So I think the people as a whole kind of picked up to that. And uh, I mean, we, we just didn't stop. Man. We just added more people every month. So nice. now, yeah, I saw. December, you know what I mean? It's kind of like, ah, you know, we scrambling to figure out what we're gonna do, but it, it's working over here. It's, it's been a blessing, man. COVID has been really bad, but at the end of the day, we all blessed. 2021, what you got? Oh, we got big stuff 2021, man. You ain't got to go into detail. Yeah, into, you, you, got, know, you yeah. know what's going on. <laughs> 2021, just, you know, training corner is going to explode on, on the major scene. We've been doing stuff now. Uh, you know, stuff with the Dodgers, we got stuff in place. And then it's Nashville as a whole, man. I think the community and everybody here, um, I just like the, the direction that the city is going. Right. Especially with the fitness level. We got a lot of great trainers here in the city. So I'm excited about that to reach out and work. And um, just build something good, man. So where Nashville will be a staple for, you know, not only just the local people, but outsiders and other pro guys, they want to come to Nashville and get the, the training that we 